Good afternoon. Uh, my name is Bob Ansaldi. I am sitting in for Nels Carmen, our chairperson of the Trails Committee, who's out of town this um, month, but he'll be back next month. So welcome, and welcome to our new supervisor, Marie Sinti. She's joining us. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to be here. Thank you. So first of all, each of you has your agenda. Any additions or deletions to the agenda? Hearing none? Okay. Um, you should have your copy of the Trails Committee meeting minutes from last month. Um, please let me know if there's any corrections need to be made. Well, you're looking at that. We'll just do a little bit of a public service announcement regarding our next Trails Committee hike, which is on January 15th, Saturday, at Ellison Park. Meet down in the parking lot near where the um, ice, ice rink is. Thank you. I was drawing a blank on that. Um, and then we will hike up to the cabin where there will be hot chocolate and other goodies. And for Fort Skylar. Fort Skylar. Thank you. Um, so hopefully we'll have either nice snow to walk in the snow, maybe even snowshoes, or dry. You know, what we hope for, you know, we don't have rain. That's the thing that's not as much fun. So any corrections to the meeting minutes? Okay, do we have a motion to approve? Anyone? Who's that? I can move it. Okay, second? I'm not supposed to, I'm ex officio. Why? Because I don't live in Penfield. Okay, well, if you say so. No, it's, it's seriously. Okay. I, I did not know that. Eleanor, you okay? I don't want to be a troublemaker, but. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, um, back in December, we had a very nice hike at Thousand Acre Swamp. There was uh, three of the Trails Committee members, along with 12 hikers. So a nice two-hour hike. It was a gorgeous day for it. Um, went and walked all the way out to the end of the Thousand Acre Swamp, then to the pond and around, and came back. So we had a really good hike. Um, as I mentioned, the hike this coming month, January 15th, just so everyone understands, um, in the brochure that was mailed out, it said the 8th. That is incorrect. The correct date is the 15th. So on the website, on Facebook, and in our little trails, Card, it says the 15th. So the only thing place that was wrong was the brochure. No, I had one of those. They had the wrong date on it too. Well, you must that, have got that. Might have been from a previous meeting, and it, then it, it was had to be because yeah. it was the 11th. Was yeah. was might the, have been uh, from November. The date the on that else was kind of reviewing it. Okay. Tim, do you have an update on the Eagle Scout projects? Um, actually, we do. Ha we are meeting with a scout tomorrow, um, Thomas Moore, about some. Uh, kiosks uh, that we want to revamp at either Sherwood or build one for Honey Creek Trail. So we're meeting with a scout tomorrow about that. Great. Speaking of the kiosks, I know there was an issue or came up for the budget or money being spent at the end of last year. Mm -hmm. Were we able to get some stuff spent? Do you know? Or? We, we did not. Uh, get anything spent as it was a little last minute um, being with the end of the, the budget. Um, but we do have, uh, I believe, um, another thousand in there for this year. So um, after discussing with Nels after our previous meeting, that'll be for these types of projects and things moving forward. So uh, like Tim said, we're meeting uh, with a Boy Scout. We've been reached out by, I believe, a couple others, one Boy Scout and one Girl Scout. Um, so we're hoping uh, that these projects continue to move forward as long as um, supplies are available and then we'll use some of those funds and um, move forward that way if needed. Yeah. Thanks, Cindy. Mm -hmm. Immediate trails need report. Um, I know there, were, there was an issue with a sinkhole that, at Shadow Pines that I let Tim know about and he's taking care of it. Is anyone else aware of any other issues on any of the trails that need immediate attention? No, so just an update. We usually, I send uh, my crew out. At, we try to do it at least once a month to check the trails for fell trees and branches and stuff like that. And we did do that between our last meeting and this meeting. 
and um, I think there was just one foul tree, um, uh, maybe Harris Whalen, I think on the upper trails. So we took care of that. So yeah. everything, as of right now, everything should be um, okay. That's amazing given the two windstorms. Yep. Right. <laughs> did anyone attend the conservation board meeting this month? Um, Ed did reach out to me when he let me know that he wouldn't be able to attend and he said he did not have anything from the converse, uh, excuse me, the conservation board to report. Okay. Um, moving down the trail fitness report, Tim. Do you know what that is? Um, nothing new on that. What exactly is that? I think it was just the the working on the trails and the kiosks and stuff, I okay. believe. And that's what we're going to get down to on new business, I believe. Mm -hmm. That's not here for easement updates. I don't have any. I wasn't given any updates from him. Yeah, I didn't have anything either. So we can go over those um, evaluation of park, trail, and kiosks. Um, so Tim and I uh, both took a, I think we picked a nice day back in December um, to be able to drive around and just kind of get a glance of what our kiosks currently look like. Uh, one of the big things that we did was measure them. Uh, looking that we do have some Boy Scout and Girl Scout projects coming up, we were thinking of having a little bit more consistency of maybe not the size of it, but maybe what is included in our information. Um, so we met and just kind of got a general size of that. And our plan is, is for when Nels comes back, we'll sit down, go over a generic, you know, what we would like to have, uh, maybe, um, you know, separated into four separate quadrants, one that has an actual trail map of information, one with park and trail rules, uh, one quadrant that talks about um, animals and insects and things like that. So um, we're going to kind of, come up with some of those things, bring it to the board, hopefully in February, uh, to be able to get some more ideas. But if anyone else has some ideas, feel free to share, reach out via email. Um, but ultimately we went around to most of the kiosks and most of them are in pretty good shape. Um, we know the Honey Creek one has been a big focus for a Boy Scout or a Girl Scout project just to be created as it's a new trail. Uh, so that's gonna be one of our focuses. And then there's a couple other that, you know, need some new plexiglass and might as well be refurbished. So we're looking to kind of get a little bit more consistent with all of our trailheads and kiosks. Did the Honey Creek Trail have a kiosk at one point? So it had one at one point behind. Um, it was on Mott Lane. It was on Mott's Lane, yes. Right. Okay. And a, a bunch of vandalism happened, so we ended up taking that one out. And, uh, and we're opting to put it on the start of the trailhead at Five Mile Line Road instead more exposure more people driving by so hopefully not a lot of graffiti and vandalism on that end so. and there's some street parking right there as well that yep. might help block from vandalism and stuff like that yeah okay sounds good anyone else have anything else that you want to bring up i went down to uh, ellison park today and uh talked to the labor foreman so that we have access to the fort for the next hike. Okay. And they're going to put firewood in there and kindling and some newspaper. Oh. And I'll, I'll be there at 9 to get every to get the everything open to go start the fire and stuff. Great. So, sounds like it should be a nice time. Mm -hmm. Highly encourage people to attend. Be nice if we had snow. Yes. Mm. Anything else, folks? Marie? I just wanted to thank everyone for their participation. Um, and I, if you have any questions or concerns, please let me know how I can support this group going forward. Thank you. Thank you. Well, folks, I would say we are adjourned. Sure. Thank, thank you very you. much. Thank you. Yeah. Thank I got you. one more question. Is, is anybody bringing hot chocolate or coffee or anything? I know someone did last year. I do not know. I don't. I don't remember who did. Um, I'll, I'll check. I'll check with Nels. I was about to say check with Nels, and then that might be something. That well, he said he was going to do it, but he's not here, so. He <laughs> sort of, if, if he doesn't bring it, I'll bring it. Unless he flies, yeah. flies back. Well, it's not to... this Saturday, so. Pardon? He's got a week and a half. Oh. 
Okay. I'm going to try to attend to so we can keep in the loop and I can help out as well. Okay. Okay, folks, I guess we are adjourned. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.